Well, hello and welcome to another weekly housing market update. My name is Kelly Pell and I'm with Keller Williams Realty here in Worcester, Mass. So we're just moving into the new season. Uh, we just celebrated Labor Day weekend and I report on uh, the information in Worcester County for Massachusetts. And as we move forward, I'll go into other towns and cities, but I, wor I work on five different data points based on the single family and condo market. So let, let's go ahead and get started. So on our active listings, we had 103 homes on the market. That's actually down from last week. And our average days on market has actually increased by seven days. So we're now at 14 days. And our median price point is 399900 Now, when we look at our price change listings, these are homes that have been on the market. And the uh, realtor and their client, the seller, have uh, talked and decided that they need to improve the price because they're not getting enough showings or offers. So actually the number of uh, price change listings is actually down. Last week it was um, about 100. Now it's uh, 68. And two of those listings actually had more than one price change. The average total price change in percentage is 3.99% with an average total in dollars of 18320 Now when we look at pending and under agreement homes, those are actually down as well as 178. And pending just means it's under contract. There's a few contingencies that need to be settled before it gets to the closing table. Average days on market was 26 days and average days to offer was 21 days. Now, as we talked about before, at the end of the month, that last week of the month, we always see an increase of the number of listings that have sold. This means that the um, deed has gone out of the seller's name into the buyer's name and the buyers have the keys and have actually moved in. So there's 251 homes in Worcester County that have sold last week. 468,168 is the average sales price. And we're still holding at the sales price to original price ratio of 101%, meaning that sellers have experienced 1% over their original price in regards to their sales price. The average excuse me, the number of expired listings is actually up, which is 42 listings that um, did not sell for whatever reason, price, condition, marketing, and 18 homes were canceled uh, in regards to their contract with their agent. Now, we always look at foot traffic, where are showings happening? I look at here Worcester as a whole, just the Worcester city, not the Worcester County. And so let's see what's happening. Again, we're in our 300 to 399 price point. We had a uh, 117 showings. So that's telling us in Worcester right now, this price point is where it's hot and where things are actually getting um, traction in regards to um, buyers looking at homes. If you're looking to sell your home, if you need some uh, guidance in regards to what to do, you're looking to move out of uh, state, let's go ahead and have a conversation. Um, I can strategically help you in making sure that we have the right marketing plan and the right plan for you to move into the next uh, chapter of your life. Now, if you're a buyer, Buyer and you're looking to buy and you're wondering if now's the right time, let's go ahead and have a conversation about that. Let's talk about what you feel uh, comfortable with as your monthly payment so that we can strategically get you into a home as well. After all, you are paying a mortgage, either it's your mortgage or your landlord's. As always, I thank you so much for tuning in each week to take um, in all of this great information that I have to share with you. Take care and have a blessed day.